Excellency uh, Zainab Bangura, my dear colleague um, C.S. Kagwe, uh, the board members of uh, the Nairobi Hospital, uh, ladies and gentlemen. My task uh, this afternoon is a simple one and it is to ask His Excellency the President uh, to address you uh, this afternoon. But Excellency, before you, allow me to say two things. The first thing is this. The moral of this story is that if you want work done on time, on budget, with excellence, put women in charge. <laughs> put women in charge. And uh, my dear sister, Zainabu, is the epitome of a woman with a warrior spirit. She knows the cost of every nail in this hospital. She made them work day and night. She was here every Friday. She was on the phone at 2 a.m. with myself and my colleague, uh, C.S. Kagwe. She was determined. We broke the ground here, Excellency, on the 20th of July, 2020. They started construction on the 6th of August. Today, we're opening a fully-fledged hospital. Where does that happen? Anywhere. Maybe uh, the only competition is General Body, but no, this one, this one, this one, the women have shown how it's done. And I want to thank my sister for showing us the way. I thank her for her leadership, and I thank her for taking seriously, sir, the vision that you and the Secretary General had for this hospital. What this hospital shows is the very essence of solidarity and cooperation. The idea that the government, the UN, and the private sector can come together in a country in Africa and build a hospital to serve humanity. We are proud as a ministry to have been associated with this project. We wish you all well. God's blessings and God's speed. With those words, I now uh, ask uh, that His Excellency uh, addresses this assembly. Thank you, sir. Santi. Uh, please be seated. Thank you very much. You know, Rachel, but it's actually true because we was it was at the Vatican last week. And it never crossed my mind until the Pope mentioned, you have a lot of women in your government. <laughs> and that's when I looked around the room and I saw Rachel, the ambassador to France, was, uh, who is a woman, the ambassador to Italy, woman, chief of protocol, woman, my PA, woman, the only men in the room was myself and the Pope. I was like, what? <laughs> so, the world is changing. 